Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Cupcake Polish Milky Way and I'm going to stamp and dot it. Here it is, all beautiful on its own. I've started off with Neltique's Formula 2 and the beautiful Cupcake Polish by the name of Milky Way. Of course the camera's not going to play nice because it's hollow. And I've topped up with Posh Top Coat. Today I'm going to be using one of the acrylic plates and this one is XY. Um, yeah, X, Y, Z, something, something, two, two. So I will definitely try to remember to link that down below. And you can't hardly see these images until the light hits right on them. I'll be stamping with Nicole Diary NS04, the silver, and using my Conad stamper and scraper. And here we go. We're just going to use the same image for all of my nails. So you can see it when the polish is on it. Excellent. And as you can see, that image just picked up beautifully. And I plopped it on my pointer finger. And I am cleaning that plate off with pure acetone. Time will tell whether it destroys it or not. So far, so good. <laughs> I don't know of any other way you would clean them. So I'm going to do what I do and, you know, hopefully they'll, they'll hold up. <clears throat> Like I said, I'm just going to put the same image on all my nails and then we'll go in and do some dotting on it. Just something a little different. A little, little one step further than the stamping. And I did wear this polish on its own for a day or two. I can't remember. Um, just to enjoy it in the sunshine. But then I knew I had to do something to it. I just had to. Good swipe. And pick up. Get that pinky out there. There we go. There we go. Smush it down. I'm going to be using the Sally Hansen Purple Heart. It's an instant dry polish and it's not a stamping polish, but um, you know, I have used them for stamping. But today I'm going to use it for dotting because it's very opaque. And I'm going to use the big end and the little end. I'm going to fill in some of these dots that look a little bigger with the big blobs of polish and then on the smaller ones I'll turn that dotting tool around and use the other little end it's a lot smaller just go in and dot on some of the designs where the little dots look smaller and I did let this dry really really good before I tried to top coat it because I didn't want to drag those dots and smear them There's what it looks like right now. And now that it's dry, I'm going to go on and cover this one up with some posh top coat. Kind of smooth those dots down a little bit. Cap that in. So there you have it, sports fans. Woody's going to make a quick appearance real quick. Do a little bit of cleanup. And there it is. So here's my swatch photo. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment. Thanks for watching and until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.